Hey friends, Julie Baker here, and um, this time I'm sitting down. I'm outside the Capitol. It's been quite a week. Just finished hosting Danny Glover, yes, the Danny Glover, at the state Capitol, and uh, he was here to support arts funding to tell his story about how important community theater is and to thank the legislature. And um, in this case, we are here to report that the legislature's budget going back to the governor includes a 75 percent restoration of arts funding, which is a great start, amazing progress. And in an incredibly bad budget deficit year, this is really something that all of us together were able to achieve. I want to thank our partners at Actors Equity, Theater Producers League of Southern California, the incredible team of California Arts Advocates and Californians for the Arts, as well as um, all of you and all the advocates out there that have um, made some noise, called your legislators and assigned the letters and um, showed up on advocacy day. It's cumulative, it all works together. Finally, I wanna give a shout out to um, our legislative champion, Senator Portantino has been with us for years now, championing the Performing Arts Equitable Payroll Fund and making sure last year it got funding and this year ensuring that it stays whole, which is what the legislature is uh, proposing. And then uh, to thank on the assembly side, assembly member Mike Gibson, for his championing of all of the uh, funding for the arts and for specifically really focusing on the California Arts Council's return in that. Right now, the budget um, has it going to $5 million uh, reduction this year and next year, and then returning back to its um, whole of 26 in uh, the, that following year. Um, it's not entirely over. Uh, now it goes back to the governor. There's still negotiations that can be had. There's still actions that you can take, but we've made excellent progress. And I think we should all be proud of the work that we've done to lift up the arts and make sure that we are indeed part of the conversation. And I will share with you that as a person who is here every day right now in the Capitol, we are being heard, we are being seen, and people are really coming together around the fact that artwork is real work and it makes a huge impact for the state of California. So thank you and um, continue to work with us and hopefully join us as members. We cannot do that without your support, particularly for our lobbying organization, which does not really get as much foundation support. It really relies on members. So if you want to continue to have lobbying like us in the state capitol, particularly during these crisis times, but really consistently building the relationships um, over the years, then we invite you to join us as members of California Arts Advocates. Thanks so much.